Pokemon Go is moving into a different dimension on the iPhone thanks to software that allows the game to play new tricks with its menagerie of digital critters. An upcoming game update relies on built-in Apple software called Arcit that gives the iPhones new ways to serve as a portal into augmented reality. Arkansas is a technology that projects lifelike images into real-world settings such as parks and streetscapes. The new approach, announced Wednesday, adds depth to the playing field and lets Pokemon monsters grow or shrink to fit their environment. The game's creatures will now flee when they detect sudden movement or if players approach too quickly. John Hankey, CEO of Pokemon Go creator Niantic, believes iPhones equipped with Apple's Arkansas software now offer the best way to play the game. That's an ironic twist because Niantic spun out of Google whose Android software powers most of the smartphones in the world. Pokemon Go has offered an Arkansas option since its release 17 months ago, but Apple's technology is more advanced than what the game has been using. Spark Capital and Peter Thiel's founders fund according to the Wall Street Journal. As Candy Crush Saga.it was the world's most popular game since it launched in July this year, with over 15 million players trying to catch them all. But Pokemon Go has also had its fair share of issues, including causing thousands of road accidents. A new study in the US suggests that more than 110,000 incidents in a 10-day period have been caused by drivers and pedestrians distracted by the game. Dr. John Ayers, who is based at San Diego University, California, said these accidents were becoming a dangerous side effect. In the game, Players must search for virtual creatures which appear projected onto their real surroundings on the screen of their phone. The study, published in the journal JAMA, concludes that the game is unsafe and causes drivers and pedestrians to become too distracted. Dr. Ayers looked at a random sample of 4,000 messages on Twitter and news reports over a 10-day period, which all contained the word Pokemon.
From this, he estimated that a total of 113,993 incidents had been reported where drivers and pedestrians had been distracted by the game.